Escape to another world. Experience the thrills. Surprise yourself with your own laughter. Relax in stunning surroundings. This is all part of Britain's most magical experience. Alton Towers. And now, from the park that brought you, Katanga Canyon. The runaway mine train. And the haunted house. the ultimate thrill ride sensation. A sensation to take you to the edge of your seat and the limit of your senses. It started as a routine excavation. But what was discovered was far from routine. It was found on site by one of the workers. We thought it might mean something. Yes, it does. It's a warning. Our earliest record is 700 years old, but the inscriptions indicate events which possibly precede a thousand years BC. Analysis of the text reveals some form of cult worship, where local populations were hypnotized and drawn trance-like to a specific site. The site was almost certainly the home of a life form. An alien life form. Leaders of the people would chant the incantation here. This was intended to invoke the creature to appear before them. And what would happen when the creature appeared? It would feed. Nemesis. Hidden, it slept. Disturbed, it awoke. And once awoken, it fed. Hidden for a millennium, discovered by man, and pinned down with steel. Now, you can take the ultimate challenge at Alton Towers in 1994. Ride and survive. This is the site of Nemesis the Ride. Now, for the technically minded, it is a multi-inversion suspended roller coaster. But for the rest of you, it's just designed to scare you. Now, down there is the station, which is the start of the ride. When we first rode the prototype, there was no doubt it is the most sensational physical experience of any amusement ride in the world. Your feet are dangling in space. 
So when you turn upside down, it really is just you and the sky. There's no vehicle around you, and it is the nearest thing to flying that you can get. Right, the station, it might just look like a load of concrete and steel at the moment, but in a few months' time, this is going to look like a horrible, great, slimy, alien monster. Now, the ride starts there and goes up in that direction, right up to the treetops, turns, comes down here, does an upside-down corkscrew under the monorail there, back down through that hole and up over the top of the station where it does a zero-g roll and turns upside down. Back down there and then climbs up to the top of those trees where it does a stall turn. Drops back down again to the bottom of this hole, does a vertical loop through a tunnel, out of the tunnel there, does another corkscrew over there into another underground tunnel under the station, another stall turn and back into the station. Wow! I will make no bones about it, I see Nemesis as the Jurassic Park of 1994 and I've got five million pounds that is going to make sure that nobody can move or hear anything without finding out about Nemesis and the other new rides at Alton Towers. In 1993 we spent four million pounds on the land of make-believe. That was always just phase one of the development. Phase two comes next year with the opening of Toyland Tours which is a two million pounds fabulous new dark ride. We intend everybody in the UK to hear nothing else but Alton Towers next year. Wow! Go to sleep, you two. Sweet dreams. Recapture your childhood at Alton Towers in 1994 and take an amazing waterborne ride around an enchanted world where toys make presents for the most magical party of all time. Toyland Tours. <laughs> just made it. I, I told us the electrics would be a bit hairy, but as usual, they just hide in their shells. <laughs> just a little joke. Right, time to go. Come on, you two. All right, all right. What have we got? Well, we've got jellies of ice creams, rides of castles, toffees and turrets, soldiers and teddy bears, but most important of all, something completely and utterly brilliantly new and thrilling. And all you've got to do is remember that toys make presents, presents make parties, and parties make happiness! <laughs> so come on! Kids, you've got to bribe them these days. The land of make-believe, now this is the best. I can eat six of these and never feel sick. The Cadbury's Chocolate House. Yum, 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 yum! A magic theatre! The carousel! Oh, the land of make-believe! But the best is yet to come, and you mustn't tell everyone, especially your parents, because we're off to my favourite place in the whole wide world! Thailand! <laughs> Toys make presents, and presents make parties, and parties make... Inflatable dinosaur. <laughs> what a silly idea. Then there's the ball striking machine. And that's the teddy bear study department. Uh -oh. Overload, overload. <laughs> and there's some bouncy castles that, quite frankly, can jump higher than anybody else. And there's the completely mixed up dollies, which is well, they're probably called dolly mixtures. <laughs> All these wonderful presents are made by the toy. And, and that's why I love this place so much. Make themselves so much better than we do. Do you find? But the best thing of all is the party. And I love parties because parties make me incredibly happy. Uh oh, someone's coming. Quick, back to bed before they find you. Come again soon, though, won't you? It was great having you. Me? Oh, why well, live here? So I'm going round again. <laughs> and again, and again, and again, and again, and again. And again. Again, too much jelly. <laughs> Toyland Tours and Nemesis represent a 12 million pound investment by Britain's number one theme park. An investment that is part of a continued commitment to making sure that the magic never ends. Experience that magic in 1994.
Thank you.